G'day, Jay Marie, Hayden here at Pacific Toyota giving you the personalized high definition virtual tour of our Nissan X-Trail ST. Uh, before I run through the X-Trail itself, what I thought I would do is show you who Pacific Toyota are. So if you haven't been to Cairns before, this is us up here. Uh, and here at Pacific Toyota, we actually have two premium used car locations. Now between the two sites, we generally stock in excess of about 180 to about 220 vehicles at any given time. So this is uh, what we class as our city site, and we're located roughly about five kilometers from uh, Cairns Esplanade. That's our showroom in the background there. If we follow Mulgrave Road up, which is just out here in front of me, about two kilometers into the suburb of Bungalow, uh, you will come across our uh, secondary site, as well as our two brand new showrooms. So we have Toyota and Lexus up there. About five kilometers around the corner, we also own Hino Trucks, Officer Lock Full Drive Accessories, and Coral Motors. To give you an idea, we are the largest pre-owned department for Toyota in Queensland and we're the fifth largest in Australia. Uh, but without further ado, we'll jump straight into the video tour of the uh, Nixon X-Trail for you. Um, so you have made a couple of inquiries on a few X-Trails. Um, I've got uh, three of them just in front of me here. So I've got a, obviously a, a graphite, a white and also a blue. Um, but the one that you uh, popped the inquiry on uh, recently was the white one here. So we'll go through the white one for you. Um, so basically, uh, to give you an idea on what I'm about to do, is just show you through the entire vehicle, just through video format. Uh, so we're going to go through all the engine bay, um, obviously all the paint and panel, interior condition, obviously all the service history that comes with the car as well. So we'll pop the bonnet here, give you a look inside the engine bay, make sure it's obviously got an engine. As you can see, nice and tidy under the hood, which is perfect that one down give you a look at the front of the bonnet there as you can see nice and tidy there as well there's no visible dents there are a couple of little stone chips on the bonnet most of these I can get touched up for you they're very superficial though um, other than that everything else is nice and tidy through the front of the bonnet there which is good coming through the front bar area now this is not a flat white, it is a pearl white, so it does have that crystal effect to it. But through the front bars, all nice and tidy. Uh, rims and tyres, so they're a factory alloy wheel, um, and they're wrapped in a Goodyear um, highway terrain tyre. As you can see, there's heaps of tread left on those, which is perfect. Take it down beside the panels here. See all the panels are nice and straight. There's no visible dents in any of those, which is good. Paintwork-wise, slight little stone chip mark just there. Bit of a scratch mark just at the back here. through to the rear. It's all nice and tidy through the rear. Inside, obviously we do have our seven seats there. Put it all nice and clean through the rear of the car, which is good. And then down the passenger side this time. So again, all the panels are nice and straight. There's no visible dents in any of those, which is good. And then paint work wise, pretty much the same as the opposite side. Again, nice and clean through there as well. So I'll show you through the second row of seats now. Conditioning vents through the rear. And all the seats are all in really good condition as well, as you can see there. We'll jump inside and turn the car on now and show you through obviously the interior of the vehicle. Also the instrumentals as well as the service history. So 
So as you can see there, 33,235 k's showing on the uh, on the screen. Uh, no warning lights, which is perfect. Uh, through all our steering wheel controls here, you have obviously all your stereo uh, controls just over here, and then all your Bluetooth controls and cruise control options on the uh, opposite side. All your window and side mirror controls just here on your door card. into our infotainment system. Um, obviously that is fitted with a reversing camera as well as you can see. Uh, but we'll turn this up so you can hear it. So as you can hear there, all the speakers are working nicely. The aircon um, is nice and cold as well, which is perfect. Uh, all your air conditioning controls are pretty much standard. So just down here, you've obviously got all your temperature, your fan speed and then all your modes that you can uh, switch through. There's a push button start, as you can see there. Uh, USB and AUX just down below, as well as a 12 volt auxiliary port. And then all your um, driving modes are just here. So you park reverse, neutral drive, and then across into a, uh, a sport shift or a Tiptronic transmission. A couple of cup holders, which are ventilated as well. So basically just turn that, and then you get the air con uh, coming through, obviously here. So if you've got a drink there, uh, it keeps it nice and cool for you. Another 12 volt auxiliary port just in here, um, but it's obviously a nice uh, deep compartment there. And all our books are just in there. Service history wise. Alright, so service history wise, we've got the first service there. 30. Sorry, so a lie. First service there at 13, again at 28, and then we've done one at 33,000 k's. So uh, it's got a full logbook service history with the vehicle, um, and as you can tell, it's um, apart from a couple of little uh, stone chip marks here and there, um, the car's been uh, very well looked after. Obviously, there's no major scratching on the dash. Um, all the interior is all in really good condition. You know, the seats aren't worn out. Um, there's no mad major stains or anything like that in the carpets. Um, all the door cards are all intact and looking nice. Um, so what we might do, we might jump out and give you a final look over the vehicle now. Alrighty, so that is our Nissan X-Trail ST in the seven seat. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you do have any further questions though, please don't hesitate to give me a call. I look forward to hopefully doing business with yourself very soon. Cheers.